If you're looking to get any coins from the cheapest, most reliable place around, be sure to check out FIFA UT store in the description. You can also open packs as well. They're cheap, automated. And don't forget to use the discount code FETCH. That's right, FETCH for 10% off. Let's go. Oh, hello. It's been a while, my little finches. It's been a fucking while. It's been like four or five days since I last uploaded to first off. Just like to say, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry about that. We're going to pick things back up. And you know what? I've been trying to qualify for the champions. Did I qualify? Did I fuck? Alright, so, the rewards look amazing. If you haven't seen them already, there are so many different things that they're doing. The further they're in the top 100 of which you finish, the better the rewards. I think if you finish first, you get like 250k, you get like a full informed team of the week pack, and some other stuff. And so basically what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be taking a look at some of the best rewards that people got from qualifying in the top 100, pretty much. Tomorrow, we're going to be doing a 1 million coin pack opening, and also I'm going to be giving one of you the chance to win 1 million coins. All you have to do is drop me a follow on Instagram, it's on the screen now, and it's also in the description. So drop me a follow on Instagram, drop a like on the video, and for every thousand likes the video gets, I will give away an extra 1 million coins to one of you. A link to everyone who features in the video will be in the description down below. So first up, we've got the Premium Team of the Week pack, right? This is my boy Dirty Mike. If you haven't seen his channel, check it out, right? He's a pro FIFA player, and he's got three Team of the Week. So you're guaranteed three Team of the Week players in this pack. He's got two of them. I don't know what he's going to get, so let's find out, man. You're pretty much guaranteed a walkout, I assume, unless you get, does he get a walkout? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Does he? I think he does. Oh, yeah, there we go. Back. He's got a walkout. So you're pretty much guaranteed a walkout in this. Who is this? Who's he got? Uh, it was Muller, right? So he's pulled himself an in for Muller. That's pretty decent, you know? You have to play 40 games. 40 games is a lot to play, but you know what? Like... It's worth it, man. It's worth it. If you're guaranteed stuff like this, the grind is worthwhile, man. It's better than sitting there and opening 40 hours worth of packs. You might as well play 40 games, man. You might as well play 40 games. Right, let's see what he gets in his next pack. Let's see what he gets. What does he get? What does he get? What does he get? He gets a Immobile. Which is pretty decent, man. It's pretty decent. Not amazing. I'd be pretty pissed if I sat there. I played all weekend to get myself an Inform Immobile. It's decent, man. They're decent packs. They're decent packs. Right, so this dude finished 95th, right? I'd say that's a pretty good achievement right there, man. That's a pretty good achievement. He finished 95th. He's got himself one Ultimate Team of the Week pack, which is like 11 full Inform players, which is crazy. He's got himself some coins, and he's got 200k packs as well. That's a pretty decent reward, man. Finishing five above, like, the lowest place. I, I take that, man. Who has he got here? He grabs himself a Mandzukic. I take that. You know, I'd be happy with that. Look at this four. This, there's 11 informed players in this pack. How crazy is that, man? How crazy is that shit? I need to get better at FIFA. I need to get myself some of these cards. If you want some of these, let me know in the comments. Say, I want some, some of these players, Finchy boy. I want some of these players. I'm going to hook you up this year. I'm going to hook you up, all right? I'm going to hook you up with some good cards. I'm going to hook you up with some good players. I'm going to up some coins, right? So if you want to win them 1 million, remember to drop me a follow on Instagram. But look at this. He didn't get no Ronaldo. He did get some pretty shitty informs, but it's not too bad. It's not too bad. So next up, these packs, there's no face cam to this dude. So, and it's in a different language, but it's, I'm judging it's a mega pack, which is a 35k pack. If you don't know, he's got himself a walkout. What has he got? And he's got himself a De Gea. Right? I, it's probably the worst one we've seen so far. You know, I'm not gonna lie, it's probably the worst one we've seen so far. It's not great, but still, man, the hair goes for like, I think it's like 200k or something crazy like that. So, I take it, man. Even if you put him in your team, he's gonna be a pretty good player, man. Let's go. Rah! So next up, he's got a lot of jumbo packs, man. He's got a lot, he's got a lot of 100k packs right there. And he's got himself one ultimate team of the week pack. It's 11 cards once again, 11 informs. He never thought I'd see this info. I never thought I'd see this. Who does he get? This is pretty, that's pretty disappointing, man. I'd be pretty disappointed with that. Let's see, that was the best player that he got. It wasn't even a walkout, so this wasn't a full inform pack from the looks of it. But still, man, wasn't great. Wasn't great. I, I, would, I wouldn't be happy with that. I wouldn't be happy with that at all. So this dude's got himself another Mandzukic. Mandzukic is pretty much like the most common the most common player that we've seen so far, I assume, from these uh, inform 11 packs. I don't know. They seem pretty much identical to the last one. It seems like you don't get the Ronaldo. You don't get anyone else. You just seem to get the most common shitty ones, which I guess is fun. But if you don't ever get like the good ones... It will wear off. I know one dude did get a Ronaldo, which was fucking crazy, but it doesn't seem like they're very common, which is understandable, I guess. But let's move on to the next pack. Right, so next up, we've got my boy Bateson, and he's got himself another three guaranteed informs. Probably not going to pull out anything decent, right? And you never do with these, right? From what we've seen so far, you never really do. And obviously, 
He did it once again. He got himself a little Coleman. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, is judging from this, would you say sitting here and grinding all weekend is worth the rewards that you get? I mean, looking at it, it looks fun, but in reality, for the time that you put in for what you get back, it doesn't really seem like it's worth it, to be honest. I mean, like, that informed Benteke is probably going to go for, like, 100k. Maybe a little bit more because you get so many. Don't forget, so many people play for champions. So many people are packing these players. Like, they're not really going to be worth anything. You probably even struggle to sell them because people are still opening packs to pack them as well. Like, in reality, sitting there for the time it takes, I don't really think it seems worth it unless you finish like really, really high up. Maybe the rewards are a lot better than like the higher, higher up you get. But next up, what have we got? This dude, how many 100k packs has this dude got, man? Jesus fucking Christ. I've never seen so, I've never seen anything like it. What's he pulling out here? What's, what's he pulling out? Is he pulling out something cheeky? What's he got? Is it cheeky? Oh, 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 he's got himself a little bit fucking mad. Well, Noya right there. Oh, I've never seen anyone pack him before. Never, never seen anyone pack Noya before, but that, that's a good fucking pack, man. If I got that, I'd be happy with that, boys. I'd be happy with that. Jesus fucking Christ. Look at it. Look at it. Damn. Right? I just, you know what? I'd take the Neuer over, like, like the three Team of the Week pack. Because chances are, I think you got a fucking Solar in there as well. Look at it. That's a pretty fucking solid pack right there. Like, in retrospect, I'd take this over the, uh, the three-player inform one. Because you don't really seem to get much in it. But this dude, again, has got an Ultimate Team of the Week pack. His record is ridiculous, man. That's some, that's some serious shit right there, man. That's some serious shit. What's he got, right? What have we got? Bang, 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 bang. And there's another Mandzukic. It seems like everyone got Mandzukic. It's like, they're not going to give you the Ronaldo. You're going to get the Mandzukic instead. So, does Foot Champion seem worth it to me? I wouldn't say so at the moment. I wouldn't say so. I mean, like, you get these, like, inform packs, but they've all literally been the same. They've all literally been the same. You don't really get anything different compared... Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. I spoke to Su... Ah, actually, I thought that was Ronaldo. But it wasn't. It was fucking Pepe. Okay. So, judging from the looks of it, would you say for champions was worth it? To me, no. Not at the moment. I mean, like, it's fun, and you get, like, a, quite a lot of coins back and all this sort of stuff, and, like, the packs are cool, but from, like, the time that you spend sitting there playing it, I wouldn't say they was worth it. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Smash that like if you enjoyed it, my dear adventures, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!